Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel where it's my opinion or no opinion at all. Scottalicious McFabulous here and I hope that you are feeling Percy. And today we are going to be talking about the brand new Coach Soho in Signature Jacquard. But in all seriousness, today we are going to be talking about how the new Coach Soho became the new Coach Ono. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But before we hop into today's Coach Soho turned Coach Ono video, if you guys love handbags, hauls, coach, luxury, the whole lot of those, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. And if you guys enjoyed today's content, make sure you hit that like button, as it does help with the ever-changing, ever-growing YouTube Al Go Rhythm. I lost all hope today. Before we start off today's video, I just want to say, Coach, you almost got me, girl. You almost got me. You almost got me, gal. <laughs> you almost did. But I was keen enough to catch it sooner or later. And you're lucky I did. I'd also like to state that everything I say in this video is coming from a place of love and not hate. Because I know some people might think that I'm being very negative or very bashful of the brand. And I'm trying to be constructive, but giving my honest opinions and not sugarcoating it and buttering it up for you. Because I know a lot of people like to do that. But that is not me. That's not me. Uh, that's okay. You can keep it. So let's talk the Soho. The brand new brand new Coach Soho in Signature Jacquard. Now, when I first seen this, I literally jumped out of my seat. I was wincing because, as we do know, I am saving up for some uh, dental work. Very expensive stuff. But I was very excited to see this bag because, as we also do know, I love collecting vintage Coach Soho bags. They are some of my favorite bags. And for the Soho being only $430, I was like, okay, $430 for the brand new Soho bag in Signature Jacquard. I can't be mad. I can't be mad because the bag is just... It's one of my favorite silhouettes Coach has created. And I'm sitting there looking through at all of them. And I'm like, oh my god, like, which one do I want to get? Like, when I get my teeth fixed, which one do I want to get? And then I'm scrolling through Instagram on their new posts about the bag. Because I'm like, I just want to, like, see what's going on. Like, I'm really excited about the bag. I'm like, oh my god, like, the Soho is back. The Soho is back. And it's looking pretty damn good. Turns out, as I'm reading through some of the Instagram comments, turns out they they snuck in the fact that it's actually recycled leather, aka bonded leather, or if you're like me, aka fake leather. <gasps> Immediately, I was gagged. I was like, wait, hold on. Hold on, is there two different bags? Is there two different versions? Please tell me there are two different versions or else I am going to have a fucking canary. I am going to lose my mind if there is not two separate bags. Because they said and. So when they said and, I was like, is there the signature jacquard? And? And? Like a Coachtopia version? Because as we do know, Coachtopia is playing with the Coachtopian leather and... Uh, bonded leather they're playing with that a lot and it seems like a lot of people do like it i'm okay with you buying that like i don't care if like honestly i don't you know what i mean i just hope that people know what they're buying because it seems like a lot of people don't so that kind of does bother me still but as soon as i seen all this i immediately went to the coach website and i was scouring i was scouring and lo and behold lo and behold there it was 
recycled leather. Recycled leather. I never wanted to throw my phone and scream over a handbag so bad. I mean, like a select couple, select, select few times, but this is definitely top three. There is no way. There is no way they are trying to sell us recycled leather on the down low, mind you, because it does not say that in the title. It just says in signature jacquard, which when it comes to coach bags, we've known to come in love to be with like gloved hand leather, like the signature jacquards with the gloved hand leather and all of that stuff. I was completely gagged. I'm still gagged that it's not actually gloved hand leather. So as soon as I seen this, I'm like, okay, the Soho signature jacquard, $430. Recycled canvas work. Recycled leather. Hell no. I then after that went to the Demi bag in signature jacquard. I had no idea I had zero clue that that was actually recycled leather as well. I am so glad, instinctively, I never bought one of those Demi bags because I came close a couple times. Because again, we know I love my vintage coach silhouettes. The Demi was on my list eventually. I was hoping to get it maybe 50% off. And now I better get it 50%. I, I Actually, I don't even think I'll buy it because, girl, I'm not supporting recycled leather. That is just not what I am about. I love leather. I love refined calf hides. I love cow hides. I love lamb skin. I don't like leather scraps ground up into a blender and then added with plastic and then not being told about it. I can't believe it took me this long to realize that the Demi was even in recycled leather. And I'm sitting here completely questioning myself. I'm like, hold on. Hold. Everybody hold on. I swear to God that was gloved hand leather, was it not? I swear to God it was gloved hand leather. I remember it being gloved hand leather. Am I crazy? And then, like, I girl, I couldn't even confirm it. I couldn't confirm whether or not it... I, have, I had no idea. I'm like, did they recently switch? I don't think they recently switched. I don't think they would recently switch. But then again, they've been selling the Demi bag back since December of 2022. Coachtopia started back in what? March of 2023? So I am really confused... Because I actually thought it was real leather. Now, I will say, when I, as soon as I seen it, I instinctfully, it, an instinct kicked in. Because I did remember feeling the leather on the bag. And being like, okay, it's leather. Like, it, there was nothing special about it to me. So, I think that's why I never actually grabbed it. Because I think deep down inside, I knew there was something lacking about the bag. And there was. Now, again, there's no shade to anybody that loves these bags. I still love them. I want them. But I don't like being... I, I will not support bonded leather. I don't... I really just... It's not good for the environment. I don't care if you are taking the leather scraps and... Like, there's so many other things that Coach could be doing with the leather scraps. They could be making, like, affordable handbag charms or something. Like, bag charms, keychains. Um, they could be, like, doing that kind of stuff. Rather than, like... Kind of, like... Under the bus. Like, under the bush. Through the grapevine. Like, feeding us this... Fake leather... On retail bags? On retail bags? Come on, guys. Why are you doing this? Why would she do that? Because she's a life ruiner. She ruins people's lives. Why are you bringing bonded leather to retail? Please keep it in Coachopia. Please. Please, for the love of God, please keep it in Coachtopia. Why make Coachtopia... And then bring it over to coach retail. That to me doesn't really make sense. Why? Why even make Coach Topia? Why trademark it? Why do all this extra work for Coach Topia when you could have in reality just did a recycled bonded leather line? Made it cheaper than outlet, but still be a retail bag. And I guarantee you, those would have flown off the shelves faster than what they did. And you would have had 
way less returns because the price would have been better. People wouldn't have felt duped. All you have to do really is just change wording. Like that's all I'm asking for. <laughs> I'm not asking for them to make the bags 100 bucks a piece and say, oh, this is fake leather. No, I'm just asking for transparency. That's about it. And lastly, before we close off today's rant video, I do also want to touch on the fact that they are using and have been using for a while signature textile jacquard that has been used from recycled material. And you're probably, some people might be wondering, oh, why are you upset about using recycled leather but not upset about recycled signature jacquard. Basically, you can take the textile jacquard, remake it into what it originally was. You cannot do that with leather. Once you shred it down, once you destroy it, you ruined it. It's done. It's no longer leather. In my opinion. But anyways, if you- oh my god. But anyways, with all of that out of the way, I'm going to show y'all a really, really sickening outfit of the day. And 99, don't believe in you. But all you need is just for one person to believe. There can be a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred people, a hundred, hundred people, a 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 hundred people, Nine thousand or nine nine hundred ninety-nine. There can be a hundred people in the room in the room in the room and ninety-nine ninety-nine. Alrighty you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's coach Soho turned coach oh no. Because girl, this is so disappointing to me. I literally literally, if I had money, I would have bought one in every color just because I like I literally have a collection of vintage Soho's. And with the new Soho coming out, I do feel it very um, of the moment to in a couple weeks time, give or take, depending what's going on. We never know over here. Um, I wanna show you guys and showcase my entire Coach Soho collection from Y2K because girl, they are sickening. And they're real leather. Yes, they are full grain and gloved hands. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's coach rant video, please hit the subscribe button if you are new. Hit that like button. Share with your friends and family. Comment to me any type of opinion you may or may not have had on today's outfit of the day or coach Soho rant video. As well, you can always support me and the channel directly by sending me a very generous super thanks donation. And you can check out the description box below for the three lucky links to my Instagram, Facebook, and Discord notification squad. I love you all to the absolute moon and back. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye. I think it was good. I don't, I don't. I'm done. I'm done. Oh, no. Show's <laughs> over. Show's over. <laughs>